I'm Mark Cowley in Mr. Saltwater Tank, and this is Mr. Saltwater Tank TV. Keeping a successful saltwater tank requires managing several factors, including saltwater and flow. I've got 450 gallons of saltwater here, and I've recently made some upgrades to the flow on this tank. I'm going to show you what those upgrades are and why I made those upgrades. First up, what are the upgrades? I added two more Ecotech Marine MP60s to my tank. I had two on there before. I added two more, bringing me to a grand total of four MP60s on this 450 gallon aquarium. Total flow produced by these pumps is 30,000 gallons per hour. Now, why did I add two more MP60s? Because of two things. Number one, I'm getting more into SPS corals again. SPS are high flow coral, so it was time to up my game. Number two, what was going on on this end of the tank? This end of the tank is the far end of the tank, which is anywhere between eight and six feet away from the MP60s on the far end of the tank. That means there's less flow because of the distance away from the pump. Now with two MP60s turned up to 100%, here's what the flow looked like. This amount of flow is ample for the LPS corals down here as they're getting moved in the current without pushing the flesh against the skeleton. And I still wanted more flow so I could get things rocking and rolling down here. On went two more MP60s, and here's the result with all the pumps at 100% intensity. For these hammer corals, too much flow. They've already retracted. And I created another problem for myself. Moving sand. With all the pumps at 100% intensity, I had some big bare spots. Here's what it looks like with all MP60s at 75% intensity. I've got a lot more flow down here, maybe even a little too much for these hammer corals. However, with the capability of managing the flow, turning it up and down and changing the modes throughout the day, these guys aren't going to get this amount of flow all the time. The changing of the flow is managed by the reef link, and here's what my current program looks like. Up top are the MP60s closest to the surface of the water. Down low are the lower MP60s. Starting at midnight and continuing through the night, I run a reef crest mode, which is a moderate energy mode. Intensity is 40%. About the time the lights start coming on, I switch to an expanding pulse mode to stir up nitritis. Then I continue the stirring but switch to nutrient transport mode. The other MP60s mirror the main pump to really get things going. In the afternoon, it's on to another high energy mode, tidal swell. This cranks up the flow to the corals when they're getting maximum light. The MP60s on the opposite side of the tank do the opposite of the main pump to create opposing flows in the tank. Mid-afternoon, all the pumps enter tidal swell mode to achieve maximum flow. Around 6 p.m., I'm getting a moment to look at my tank, so I switch to lagoon mode to let the fish have free reign in the tank, and so I can pop some photos. Before bed, it's back to nutrient transport mode to flush down any uneaten food from the day. At dusk, the pumps gear down to let everyone bed down for the night. With the four MP60s on the tank, I can create high flow patterns and low flow patterns and vary these flow patterns throughout the day. That means with these various flow patterns, I can satisfy the various needs of the various corals in my mixed reef tank. This is gonna create better growth for the corals and a better viewing experience as the corals aren't all standing still or all looking like they're getting blown over by the hurricane that's passing through. And with the reef link managing the changes automatically in the background, that means it doesn't require any inputs from me. Now all that's left to do is sit and wait, watch the corals grow, and of course, frag when the time is right. I'm Mark Kelly and Mr. Saltwater Tank. This has been Mr. Saltwater Tank TV. Till next time, have a good one, enjoy your tanks, and know your tank personality. All right, suckers, grow. Grow, 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 grow. Faster, faster, faster.